YouTube Chicks <laughs> Get ready You know what to do Chicks so listen, Chicks Smooth Hey Chicks Smooth Appreciate all the coverage that you been doing I've been watching your shit for a while I just subscribed to your shit too bro Hey man, Quavo is not ducking no smoke, he's not going out sad. If you guys are not paying attention to this Quavo and Chris Brown this song back and forth, I promise you that you are completely missing out on some good diss records. Now previously it was Chris Brown who responded back to Quavo, he dropped a full diss record called The Weakest Link. Now I told you guys in that video, Quavo's only option right now is to go get Offset. I don't care if he's too busy having a money fight in the strip club, go manage your issues with him because you need him right now. Looks like Quavo enlisted the help of a different Migo, RIP Takeoff. He just dropped his own diss response via academics. The diss song is called Over Hoes and Bitches and he has Takeoff on the hook. Now this comes after Chris' most disrespectful lyrics on his own this song where he said, yo, when Takeoff passed, everybody was really wishing that it was you. So for everybody saying why did Quavo go and involve Takeoff in this this, Chris was the one to kind of involve him unofficially. These lyrics from Quavo, I'm not gonna lie, these are actually kind of fire. He said, talking about fashion week, you sparing who? Come punch me in my face, it ain't nothing but a fade, you know you lost a Frank. Niggas ran in your house, tied up your aunts cause you're in pay. This bullet got your name, Chris. Don't ever bring up take, pussy. Now Quaver continues saying, Lil boy wanna die about some coochie. You still fucked up about Karuche? You tried to beat up Tiana, no cap, but Usher wouldn't let you do it. The cocaine got him, your honor. Listen man, Quavo completely went there with Chris Brown. He's not ducking any smoke. He's going very personal with this diss song, which is really the only place you could take it after Chris disrespected him on The Weakest Link. Now, I ain't gonna lie, I think this one might take Chris over the edge. It's one thing to diss him over beating women, but the cocaine allegations, Chris has literally denied that so many times. Even though there's been footages and videos taken of him at different places that may suggest otherwise. Listen, you guys know me, I will always call it fair. This was a really good diss song. I don't think Think Chris needs to respond back with anything. I think both guys got their shit off on each other and both guys prove that they belong in the rap game. But now the next phase after this gotta be fisticuffs. A squabble now has to take place. However you guys want to handle it, you can set up a 1v1 and just do it behind closed doors with no cameras. Or if you guys are feeling really tough, find out where the other person is gonna be, maybe a club performance and just show up. But I'm not gonna lie to you guys, Quaver really did surprise me. I didn't think he was gonna come out with anything, I thought he was just gonna stay silent the man really went in the booth and did his thing i gotta give props you guys tell me what you thought about this quave with this record and should chris brown respond back to this does he need to respond back to this push comments below subscribe to my channel like this video i'll see you guys later man hey guys shop with my boy chick smooth at chicksmooth.shop